Good evening. Private attorneys have been appointed to Milwaukee sisters accused of shooting a George Webb employee. Now this comes after the state failed to appoint public defenders. Bruce Harrison details that shortage of attorneys is a problem that's only getting worse and costing you money. The sisters had been waiting in jail for months to be appointed lawyers. Now they have them, but it's going to come at a greater expense to, well, me and the rest of us who pay taxes here in Milwaukee County. There was a sense of weariness in Judge David Feiss's courtroom this morning. Has your office been able to find counsel for Ms. Johnson? Uh, your Honor, we have not. A problem that's getting worse. Once a rare issue, the state no longer has enough public defenders, especially those qualified to try homicides. Many of them have expressed interest, but have also said they cannot today accept another homicide appointment because they have already so many. Brianna and Brianta Johnson are charged with first degree intentional homicide. Investigators say in January they argued with a George Webb employee before shooting him and beating him. Unable to afford attorneys, they waited on the state. I don't think we have ever seen a situation where we've had such a significant shortage of lawyers. Thomas Reed runs the public defender's office in Milwaukee. He says there are hundreds of defendants without counsel right now. And that's despite public appointed attorneys clearing dozens of cases a day. Since the pandemic, private bar attorneys certified by the state have fallen by 35 percent in the county. Reed believes some of those attorneys nearing retirement decided not to come back post pandemic. He also says there's higher turnover among his staff with up to five vacancies at a time. This is, it's unfortunate for you. This shouldn't have taken two months. It's unfortunate for the taxpayers of Milwaukee County. The shortage has forced the county to appoint defense attorneys for both Johnson sisters. Private attorneys appointed by and paid for by the state work at $70 an hour, but the county pays $100, meaning residents here will be paying more than usual when some cases go to trial. Reporting in Milwaukee, Bruce Harrison, TMJ4 News.